Okay, thank you, Scott. <laughs> well, a little rain and some snow is in our forecast. John Milan is here with the latest. Yeah, we have a rain-snow area which is going to be rolling through the area, but the bigger snow, uh, which will be Tuesday night, tonight, and right through tomorrow, will be to our south. We're right on the northern edge. We're not going to see all that much. And then on Wednesday, right behind the storm system, here comes the Arctic air, and we'll start out around 20 degrees in the morning hours, but temperatures will be dropping through the teens most of the day. Here's the snow we're expecting about an inch, uh, especially Milwaukee, Waukesha and south one to two inches near the Illinois border. If you're going down towards the Chicago area, three to five inches just south of the border. It's raining right now everywhere. The moderate showers are right now uh, southern Waukesha County down into Racine County, also southern uh, Milwaukee County and then scattered showers all the way out through Jefferson County, Dane County, scattered showers to our north also. And they're coming in from the west, everything moving to the east at about 25 miles per hour. And check out the rain all the way to the Mississippi River. It started to change to snow. It's going to actually be a rain snow combination just west of the Mississippi River. That'll start rolling across the state later tonight as colder air intercepts it from the north. Uh, the cold air is up there. It only hit 30 in International Falls, 34 in Marquette. It's starting to sink to the south. These are high temperatures. We hit 49 degrees again today. You probably notice a lot of melt still going on around the area. And we're still at 41 in Fond du Lac, 41 in West Bend, also in Kenosha, 38 in Milwaukee, Port Washington, 41 in Whitewater and Lake Geneva still at 40 degrees. And you see Madison still at 40. So it's going to take a little while for that rain snow to change over probably at least till 10 o'clock tonight. And when it does so, probably after midnight, it'll be all light snow, 20 degrees or overnight low in Milwaukee. This will be close to the temperature, high temperature for tomorrow. Temperatures will drop in the teens during the day, upper teens everywhere else for lows overnight tonight. Our satellite radar combination shows the big energy right here, and that'll be the storm that'll pass to our south. And we're going to see a lot of clouds till about midday uh, tomorrow. Most of the snow will be out of the picture early. Here's a low as we track it to our south. Again, you see the heavier precipitation from northern Illinois through northern Indiana. Cold air rolls in, but look what's going on right behind it. Another low pressure system that will keep our roller coaster temperature pattern. And we'll be back in the 40s by Friday. 20 is the high tomorrow, but I think temperatures will be dropping through the day on that strong north wind. 16 Green Bay, 15 out in Wausau with morning flurry. So the rain changes the snow probably after 10 o'clock tonight. We get an inch by morning, two inches. Kenosha, southern Walworth County, strong northeast winds, 18 degrees. 20 is your morning high. Temperatures are dropping slowly through the day, clearing skies by afternoon. Windy north winds at 15 to 20 miles per hour. Six is your overnight low tomorrow night under partly cloudy skies. And Thursday, partly cloudy, breezy, just a tad warmer, but still cool. For this time of the year, high 36. But then by Friday, on your Storm Team 4 10 day outlook, we're back in the mid 40s with lots of sunshine, sunny and 35. On Saturday, look at the temperature on Sunday dropping back to 28. But we could see some 40s towards the middle of next week.